Yo guys, a new video. I'm gonna keep that on. And this is a bit some of the last score. Now I tried up one footage of the game and another like just like this video up. So this is the failed, you cannot upload these. I try to find a solution to upload them, did it work? So also you're gonna get no footage from the game guys, I'm sorry about that. But if you go and look my Instagram page, you'll see I took a picture of the stadium inside. So yeah. Anyway, if you want to know slow it was four one to Arsenal. So we're going down so I'll need to start planning what away games I'm getting. Because we're going, we're going down, I know. I won't be surprised. I won't, I won't be judging Jermaine Defoe to move this January, not next January, next year, whatever. <laughs> I won't be judging him to move because we're that rubbish. Should move to Bournemouth or something. No, I has got too rubbish. Uh, and there's like only two players I'd keep in the squad. Well, that are doing decent. I mean, from Pickford. Pickford's pretty small. I think we need Benoni back on six three. Pickford's only about six foot one for a keeper. I should also got all these goals in as well. But I got on with the game, these guys now. Uh, so the game kicked off, and you know I thought we were actually the better team. Getting up there, trying to get shots, but weren't doing that. But weren't getting the shots, but we, yeah, we were still getting up there, doing things. In fact, I thought we were key bossing our show around a wee bit because we we're doing some skills. The joke, tricking them. Uh, then they had their first attack. Miss also got played three. She's a put down bottom corner, but Bigford saved it. Like caught it anyway. So it's then a wee tad equal between each teams until the 19th minute when Hector Bellerin decides to cross it in. And how can how big Tony, you're six foot four, Sanchez is about five foot nine. How can you no handle him? And yet Alexis Sanchez to head it in to make it one 0 to Arsenal. In the 19th minute, so there we go. And then I'd say been been the better team. Arsenal still had good chances, should have been a bit four 0 up by half time. So that it could have been eight one. I uh, uh then uh, second half started. Yet again, I thought we were actually kind of boss in Arsenal. And then in the sixth, fourth minute, Coney pulls the ball up to Watmore. Watmore's on the run. He tries to do the keeper, but Chick brings him down, and it's a penalty, Sunderland. Oh, and I went mental when that happened. And then, who better than. Mr. Default, step up, make it his fifth of the season. And I went mental when that went in. Then things changed. Seven minutes later, Druid comes in the 70th minute. But then the next minute, he gets a goal. <coughs> Sunlone man, honestly. I'm more joking, we're officially the worst Premier League team now. Since 1990. Because one team, don't know who it was, and they won a game in 10 games, so we haven't won a game in 10 games now. We had won a game in 8, not 9. Last season, I was against Newcastle, I remember doing the Hangway in here. In this house, the review. <laughs> um, so I'm still on Sunderland, you know, as I'm speaking in this video. So there you go, there's a the second went in. And we were chatting, you're only singing when you're winning. Singing when you're winning, you're only singing when you're winning. So chat that. 
Then, four minutes later, Gerard gets his second. He's been on five minutes and two goals. How is that? Right, that tells you we're the worst Premier League team now. We're going down. Then, three minutes later, yet again, defensive error, Sanchez puts a fourth and I'm just leaving the stadium because I'm like, I mean, people should be saying, why are you leaving the stadium? Why don't you support your team? Well, any Celtic supporters, you stay brilliant. And even if you were losing 4 0 and even brilliant, then you don't leave. But it's different because we are shite. There's the difference. But anyway, I just left the stadium from there. So. That was it, guys. I was at the game. Even going to look up my Insta page, I've got a picture of the of light inside. Half time. Honestly, we're going to. Honestly, it's been a very bad year. Next game, I think it's Hull. I don't know if it's home or away. No, in fact, it should be home because we've had two away games in a trot before. Never win against Hull. We always lose, but they've just been doing just as bad. They've got mere points in this, but they've been doing just as bad. They've had three loses in a row now. They lost. Eight on the hink. We've had three loses in a row as well. Lost 1 0 to Watford, 2 0 to Stoke City, and 6 0 to Bournemouth. So, it's getting me a little pumped up for the game, but I think my next game. I actually be going to it might be in December it's either going to be Leicester or Watford I might not be able to get them but I'll try they might be the only two games I'll be able to get but anyway guys this is the end of the video I'm really not happy with the team now There's no luck or anything happening with so anyway guys Speak to you later. In peace.